Well, hey, 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 what is going on, everybody? So welcome to my tutorial this afternoon. And so basically what I'll be going over with you on, guys, is how to install the Open Shop channel on your Wii. Uh, so what is the Open Shop channel? It's basically the resurrection of the old homebrew browser. And what it allows you to do is download applications over the internet directly from your Wii. Now that's pretty cool. Uh, glad they brought it back. Um, so without further ado, uh, we're going to jump over the computer here guys I'm going to show you where you're going to download the file and where to put them and all that good stuff Okay, so uh, let's, let's get the install on this thing. How about that? Awesome. Cool Okay guys, uh, so we're going to head on over to our web browser here And so this is the uh, Mediafire site that I uploaded the file to it's my personal upload actually and uh, you just come over here guys and uh, click on this download button and that's it uh, I've already got it downloaded uh, so I'm gonna go ahead and extract it real quick right here on the desktop all right and I'm gonna pull up my SD card from my from my Wii here <clears throat> this is it right here uh, Let's do this right here. How about that? Okay, so here's my SD card. Uh, this is your download right here. Uh, basically, what, what you're going to do is you're going to take your homebrew browser folder with all your goodies in it, and you're just going to copy it basically over into your apps right here. That's what you're going to do. Simple as that. Um, let's just drag it on over, guys. And this comes with a, a guide here and also a readme text. Uh, so it has everything. Everything's good. So replace some files there. I don't know what I'm replacing. I probably got the old homebrew browser channel in here somewhere. I don't know. But yeah. That's that. And now, guys, that is absolutely it. And like I said, you got your uh, browser guide here, a readme text here. Uh, so you're all good. Uh, if you have any problems, just come back in here, guys, and uh, check out the readme file and stuff. So now we're ready to hop on over to the Wii, guys. Yeah. All right, let's check this browser out, shall we? All right. Okay, guys. Uh, so here we are. We are on the Wii. And before we get started, guys, make sure you're connected to the Internet uh, with your Wii and also this is very important too. I've had problems with this uh, a few minutes ago uh, The SD card when I when I put it into the Wii it went to the locked position Okay, I've been having problems with that and I finally had to put a piece of little a piece of tape around it where to keep that little uh, sliding uh, deal uh, on the unlocked position, okay, so as long as you got those two things going on, guys, it's all good. We can head on over to the homebrew channel right here. Um, I've actually still got the homebrew browser channel up, and uh, I don't know if it'll work with this or not. Uh, I'm not going to try it right now. I'll try it later, but let's just go through the homebrew channel. Okay, so here is our uh, homebrew channel here guys, and here's our homebrew browser So we can just we're just going to go ahead and click on that right there and hit load Now it started staying up it, it, it'll start downloading certain files and things like that. Just let it do its thing guys. All right Let's see, wait a sec Okay, and so here we are, the homebrew browser, guys. Uh, uh, you have 
all these different options at the top. You got demos, you have emulators, uh, games, media, and also utilities. Um, it's actually downloading some, uh, I, well, let's see. Let's go to help over here. And, no, that ain't it. Go right here for a second. Oh, I'm already in it. Okay. <laughs> anyway, once you get right here, guys, hit your home button. And go into settings. And right here, if you want background music, you can check this off. I, I kind of prefer background music. Uh, it's pretty, pretty cool. But you have different options. You, you got like five pages of options here. Uh, Rumble and uh, stuff like that. Use SD card. But yeah. Pretty cool guys. Uh, this is a pretty cool little uh, deal here. Um, I don't know what kind of emulator. Let's see. I don't know if it has anything really newer than uh, what, what the old homebrew browser had. I don't know. But yeah, here it is guys. You can, uh, instead of going on a computer and having to take your SD card out and doing everything on a computer, you can just sit right here and in your chair and just download emulators and stuff like that. What would be awesome though, you know, on the, on the Nintendo Switch, they come out with like an HP G Shop or whatever it was where you can download uh, Switch games and stuff like that. I would love to see somebody come up with like a, uh, a shop channel or, or you know some kind of shop browser and uh, where you can download Wii games and download GameCube games and things like that. E even little retro games and stuff like that. That would be so sweet, man. I'm telling you, this would be so sweet. And, uh, but yeah, uh, there you go, guys. Uh, the homebrew browser resurrected guys this is the open uh what's it called the open uh open shop channel is what it's called so that's that guys that's it for this tutorial uh hopefully i can come out with some more tutorials on the wii uh i'm just kind of scrounging around you know what i mean and uh trying to find some stuff so uh there it is and so I hope it helped you guys out. Uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna leave y'all at that, and I hope it helps helped you out, guys. And uh, I'll see you guys later. It's Bobby signing off. Y'all have a good one. All right? Cool.